Also happening tonight, the series finale of Washington Park Wednesdays. It is Youth Music Night at the Washington Park Band Shell. Here to capture it all, Cassandra McShepard. Hey Steve, as you said, it is the last concert of the series. You know, we were here to kick it off, but we kind of got kicked out because of the rain, but we will not be stopped. And I'm here with Be Free. Can I tell you how much I love your name? Be Free from 88.9. This woman is so talented. I don't even have time to do her full intro. I'm going to have you tell us a little bit about yourself. Thank you. So I am Be Free, as she said, and I'm a singer, songwriter, producer, musician, and curator here in the city of Milwaukee. And tonight I'm here in the capacity of the Music Education Coordinator for 88.9 Radio Milwaukee for our collaborative event with Washington Park Wednesdays. I love this. You said a whole lot in a little bit of time. But let's talk about again the curator and it being Youth Night. Yes. So um, we have had the pleasure of setting up different shows throughout the season. And originally this was supposed to be in 2020. And we wanted it to be a big event with MPS. But we condensed it to, to be something that can be celebrating the youth, which we try to do at Music Lab. And also set as our first summer activation event with 88.9 because they're going to be set up celebrating the winners of their scavenger hunt that's been going on for the last few weeks. Awesome. Now, I'm loving this whole music lab for kids. So some of the uh, people who have been, the young people who've been in the lab are going to be performing tonight, yes? Yes. Both of the acts that are on stage right now have been involved in music lab in this past season and before then. And we wanted to find a great representation of the lab, but also with the talent that the city represents. And both Trinity Grace and Negative Positive are wonderful acts, very diverse, very confident, very stellar in their performances, and happy to be having that as a presentation of celebrating back to school and what the city can represent for their youth. I love this, and I can say they're very young. As a matter of fact, positive, negative, or negative positive, which negative positive. Are negative positive, sorry. See, I'm not very young, but <laughs> negative positive met when they were 10 years old and they're on their way to college now. As a matter of fact, this season that they're doing right now is part of their graduation tour that they did for the uh, summer because most of them are actually graduating high school, so it's really, really cool. And we love the fact that Music Lab has been able to take such diverse people and bring them into different settings like this that they might not see on a regular basis. So make sure you guys look out for Music Lab because we're going to be starting off our season coming up in the end of September. Be free. Can I just say that? Be free. Be free. <laughs> Thank you very much for joining us tonight. Steve, I'm going to toss it back to you, but only for a minute. I got more for you. I am so glad the weather's cooperating with you this time around that you can show this to everybody. Yeah, the flies are biting, but it's not raining. <laughs> it's mosquito weather too, so just... Get ready for some of that. All right, Milwaukee making some international news today. Mary